everyone. So I'm going to do the summer tag that I've been seeing on YouTube. So let's do the first question. What's the summer lipstick I like? Um, so right now, since I'm traveling, most of my um, lipsticks are in Ta uh, LA because in Taipei, if you bring your lipsticks, it's going to melt. <laughs> so actually, I bought this Maybelline um, Baby Lips. Um, I just really like the smell of it. And then also, I just use this to fill out any lip liner I have. Right now, I don't have a lip liner. And I just fill it out with this color, so it just changes with, with any color I have. So the next question, nail polish that I'm loving. Um, I do have nail polish in LA, but I didn't bring it. Um, but I usually have, like, if you see my nails, um, I usually use, like, pearly white color. Because just the white color goes with any kind of clothes you're wearing. And I'm kind of like a minimalist girl. So, um, I didn't bring it, but if you follow me on Pinterest, you'll see some of the colors I really, really love. And some of the nail, nail polish I really love, and I have it in LA. Um, so the next, third question is, what's the bikini that I really love this summer? So I have this. It's called Julie uh, Gilly Hicks from Gilly Hicks. Um, it is just so cute. Look at this, um, the fold on it. It's just so cute. And it has like wires here and padding. Um, the only thing is I'm a 36C, 34-36C. I think I'm a 35 right in the middle. This just, it kind of, it holds me okay, but it's not something I can jump in the water diving or anything, um, probably just like, you know, sunbathing, which Asian people don't sunbathe, <laughs> we're all about whitening. So this is like something I really like, and the bottom looks like this, and I love how the side is like this, so cute, I really like this. Um, and there's another one, that one piece I have, it's called Miracle Suit, this thing also has this fold I really love, it's just so romantic, it's like this. And it kind of, it, the, there's like, it just, it has like, almost like spandex, so it pulls you in when you wear it. So if you're someone that needs a little bit help, this would totally work. But when you wear this, it doesn't dry that quickly. So if you're um, next to a poolside and you're like tanning, not tanning, but you're sunbathing, like wearing this is kind of wearing a wetsuit. Um, but if you wear this, it just dries up really, really quickly. Okay. So the next question is, what's my favorite Starbucks Frappuccino? Um, I'm not drinking that much Frappuccino right now because in Asia everybody's like a size 0 or negative 2. <laughs> so I've been trying to diet like crazy and I've been drinking this. So if you come to um, Taiwan, you would see 7-Elevens like every 10 steps. And this is the drink that has no sugar right here. It says Wutang. It's like made from Japan. And the taste of it isn't bitter. Oh, okay, there's a little bit bitterness. Um, but it's not too bad where you feel like you need sugar. So this, like in the morning, I definitely need caffeine. So I, I always buy this. It's like a 35 NT, I think. It's like a dollar and five cents. Okay. The next question is, what's my favorite fake tan? So Asian people don't have fake tan, <laughs> don't use fake tans. They're all about whitening. So I'm gonna switch it up to what's my um, sun care? What's my favorite sun care? So I really like this Neutrogena Dry Touch Sunblock. So this one, when you put it on, it doesn't. So here's the texture of it. So when every time you have like some SPF, it gets like a little bit oily afterwards and it kind of gets really, really heavy. This one, the, I, they have some kind of technology where right after you put it on, it just dries up pretty quickly. It absorbs really quickly and it's exactly what it described right here. It says, feels clean and weightless and fast absorbingly skin soft and smooth. Now usually advertising whatever the packaging is, I don't believe this. <laughs> But this totally, exactly like this. It's exactly what it just described. So I would recommend this to anybody. Um, it has a pretty strong floral scent. Um, it's actually waterproof, sweat fruit, resistant to rub off. It's non comedogenic, which is, doesn't clog pores. It says light, fresh scent. It's not that light. Um, and it's uh, PABA free. Um, I gotta look at that. So, this one, 
it's a, it's pretty good smell. And after you put it on 15 minutes, you can um, go out. So let me see what the next question is. Okay, what's my favorite um, summer accessory? This. <laughs> So you gotta, you definitely, a girl definitely needs something to put your hair up. And also most of my jewelry, everything, accessory is in LA. So I'm in Taipei right now. So I read somewhere and I saw another girl on YouTube. I, she's the one, oh, I forgot her name. She has like voluminous long hair. And basically uh, the article and her, both her and the article said, at night you want to pull your hair up and um, wear your hair in a ponytail, a loose ponytail to kind of prevent your hair from friction against your pillow so it would like maintain your hair so I've been using this and using this is the reason why it's, it's less you know stress on your hair so I really like this and I just usually like put it on when you go out it's very easy to use so the next question is, what's my favorite fragrance? So if you've seen my other videos, I've, I've been talking about like how this doesn't last very long, but I love the smell of this. So I still haven't found a favorite fragrance in Taipei here or actually anywhere because I'm very particular in smell. I don't like anything too sweet or too, too floral. This is like really refreshing and citrus. This is called the pink um the pink uh grapefruit one and this one the same line has like i think four other flavors i didn't like any of the flavors any of the other smell this is the only one that i like the funny thing is the the only other uh, fragrance i like was like the zaro the guys line the cologne but i didn't like any of the zaro's female um perfume so i'm like very bizarre <laughs> But this one I really like. If you guys want to go check it out, uh, I'll put the link below. Um, but the problem with this is that it doesn't last very long. So I kind of use this to just pick myself out, uh, up. Like if you have a boyfriend or you go on a date and you're gonna, you want to smell good, it this doesn't really last very long, but it kind of picks you up. So if you, you're, you're trying to smell good to someone else, you probably need something else. But if you're trying to just like refresh yourself and your senses, you can, I think you should get this. Um, let me see, what's the next question? What am I most excited to do this summer? Oops, switch up the camera. Um, since I'm in Tempe, I'm most excited to try all the ice stores, like the ice shop, the dessert ice shop, like the shave ice, snow ice, uh, homemade gelatos here. Um, a lot of the seasonal fruit in Taiwan, they make it into homemade into their own gelato and ice cream. Um, so I'm really, really excited to, to try that because I noticed the fruit here and the vegetables in Taipei are so much better than California LA. It tastes so much better. So that's the most exciting I'm doing, um, when I'm here. So uh, if you want to do this video, uh, the summer tag, definitely um, comment below and tag me and let me know so I can tag you too. And I hope you guys have a good summer. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up, subscribe below. And the things behind here are things I talked about and things I will be talking about later. So hope to see you guys again next time. Okay, bye!